Very correct people, mommy said in a cow as we heard, locks Kabiesi outside uh, her Akira mansion for the first time in history. As Queen Naomi is angry with Kabiesi for deceiving him. Okay, right now we heard that Kabiesi was so disturbed yesterday that he couldn't sleep. He was walking up and down in his uh, chamber throughout the night. And we heard that immediately uh, the sun break, the day break, I mean, Kabiesi left uh Kabiesi left Ileife immediately to go and uh, see Queen Naomi because as we heard that since yesterday that Mommy Tedinika will announce that she is no longer returning back to the palace. We heard that Kabiesi has been calling her phone. Yes, Kabiesi has been calling Queen Naomi, trying to reach her and Queen Naomi wasn't uh, picking Kabiesi's calls. Yes. If a praise them has told Kabiesi that uh, the Akira elders came pleading for Queen Naomi to be set free traditionally so that Queen Naomi will go and get a new husband for herself, which they refused and insisted that uh, it is Kabiesi that has the final say where Queen Naomi is. They don't know anything about um, setting Queen Naomi free traditionally until Kabiesi gives order. Yes, because we heard that before Queen Naomi enter palace say she walked on a blood and that is a covenant that she sealed with Kabiesi that she is not going to leave uh, the palace. So right now we're everywhere, don't already they tight. Everywhere they so complicated. There is no peace. There is no joy. Kabiesi's wife are bringing children into the palace. We don't know whether they are the ones giving birth to those children or they are just, uh, you know, trading for children just to get hands on Kabiesi's uh, properties. Because like if a priest them always say that they are in for a mission, they are not in the palace because they love Kabiesi. They are there to achieve their different uh, plans. So right now, Kabiesi, it has gotten to his notice that uh, Naomi is seeking for, you know, to live uh, entirely out of the palace. She doesn't want to, you know, be married to Kabiesi. She wants to be set free traditionally. And Kabiesi was totally devastated throughout yesterday night, as we heard. He couldn't sleep. Yes, Kabiesi yesterday, as we heard, he was walking up and down in his chamber. He was calling Queen Naomi repeatedly, and Queen Naomi did not speak any calls. So, this morning, we heard that Kabiesi left the palace so early with uh, his royal entourage to go and meet Queen Naomi in Akire to give us some explanation. But Queen Naomi, as we heard, did not agree to open the gate. Because not be today where Kabiesi start to give Mommy Tedenika will explanation. No, not be today. Oh. He don't say where every day. Now, so Kabiesi go, they promise with Naomi, I will make it up to you. I will do this for you. I will do that. You will come back as the first wife. You know, Kabiesi keep on making, you know, unfulfilled promises. Promises that are not fulfilled. And when Naomi has been believing him, every day by day right now it seems like kabiesi is deceiving queen naomi it's not just that it seems that is what kabiesi is doing yes that is what he is doing kabiesi is totally deceiving queen naomi so right now queen naomi has find out that kabiesi did not truly love her maybe kabiesi is using her for protection because uh, you know, she gets child for Kabiesi, then Kabiesi is now playing with her emotions. She said no, that it is time to put an end to all this drama. It is time for her to move on with her life. And uh, Kabiesi, as we heard on the other hand, said no, that uh, he is not done with Queen Naomi. He is still in love with Queen Naomi. He still cherish her. She still adore her. Someone that you cherish, someone that you adore, you cannot respect that person. Because Kabiesi doesn't have any atom of respect where Queen Naomi is. My correct people make a great to first before we carry this GC go.
Good morning, afternoon, evening to you all. According to your time and the time where we're going to take the see this video, yeah, welcome back to Tessie TV, and we are still on the gist about uh, waiting the soft for parlors. My correct, correct people go tell on the complete truth. If people are happy that Ashley gave birth, it is just 10%. 10% that are happy. Plenty people are not happy because they did not understand how it happened. They did not understand how the whole thing went. People are baffled. People are unhappy. That's why you see that Kabiesi keep on disgracing the throne of Hilefe. Yes, because this is a total disgrace. Someone that you have not heard before that she's pregnant, you know, and all that. The nice thing you hear is that this person has given birth not to, an, uh, to a female child, but to a male child. That shows that she is also in for the property. She is also in that palace for her own mission, to achieve her own mission. And the, what we are hearing is that... Ashley is so mean in taking the crown of Kabiesi back to her place. Because we heard that even before Kabiesi become a, a king, that already Ashley's grandfather has been king before in the, you know, in the 18th to uh, 19th century. So nobody knows whether she is in there to take the throne back to her place. That is what people are insinuating that she wants to take the throne of Elefe people back to her compound. So right now, Queen Naomi has seen the whole drama and she said it is not what she's going to put herself into. Queen Naomi is a woman of peace, like we all know. She's a vicious woman. She's a woman of love. She's a woman of understanding. She had to put an end to all the things going on as we heard that the elders went to Akira elders went to Kabi uh if a priest them seeking for Queen Naomi to be set free. The next thing they did was to run to Kabi AC and complain to Kabi AC waiting Akira elders are demanding. And right now Kabi AC is running helter skelter, trying to meet Queen Naomi, trying to explain to Queen Naomi to exercise patience to you know. To start all the promise, all the broken promises that she made to, uh, he made to Queen Naomi, he wants to start making new ones. But Queen Naomi said she had had enough. And we heard that Kabi Esi has been outside Queen Naomi's gates in Akira for the past 13 minutes. The entourage has been knocking. They have been shouting for Queen Naomi to come out and open the gates for Kabi Esi to enter. For the first time in history, we heard that Queen Naomi said no. That let Kabi Esi go back to his beloved wives and leave her alone so my correct correct people now waiting the so for palace as we had alleged i beg and i beg make a trick mark for this matter drop your comments give this video a thumbs up subscribe stay tuned stay connected for more updates to be dropping from time to time about waiting the so for palace as alleged and for my returning subscribers i can never cease to appreciate you guys